and my text subtext is deity. Deity, that's all right. Deity, God's only begotten Son. All right, yes. Okay, thank you, Jesus. Jesus, Jesus, oh, what a wonderful child. Jesus, Jesus, holy, meek, and mild. New hope to all we bring. Oh, yeah. Give some church to the angels sing. Sing glory, glory, glory to the new born king. There's but one Jesus. There's but one king. Anybody who tries to be a king cannot be a king over Jesus. John 3.16 says he is God's most precious possession. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believe in him yes. will not perish, yes. but have everlasting yes. life. All right. Hallelujah. Praise, praise. Thank you, Jesus. Right. My prayer is coming out of, I think it's out of Psalms. We read it already. Yes. Blessed be the Lord God, All right. the God of Israel, mm -hmm. who only doeth wondrous things. And blessed be his glorious name yeah. yes. forever. And let the whole earth be filled mm -hmm. with his glory. Mm -hmm. yeah. Amen. 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 And Reverend Myers already sung us out, so I just have to exclude that part. Thank you, Jesus. I want to read from Romans 13, 11 through 14, King James. And that knowing the time, that now it is high time to awake out of sleep. Tell the story. Okay, we can't sleep anymore. It's time to get up, yeah. praise the Lord. Uh -huh. For now is our salvation yeah. nearer than when we believed. Right. I remember when I began to believe. And I'm nowhere like I was then. Yeah, right. I knew I believed, but I didn't know it was going to take me into this realm of my life. Right. And I just thank God for that, thank this you. realm. Amen. The night is far spent. The day is at hand. Oh, Jesus. Let us therefore cast off the works of darkness. Yeah. And let us put on the armor of light. Yeah, yeah. Let us walk honestly as in the day. Yes. We, we do a lot of stuff at night. You know that? Mm -hmm. yeah. I remember. I was something. Right. I was in the army. You know I was something. And then now, in daytime come, put on that press uniform and step out there and walk like nothing was wrong. Everybody thought I was the big, best saint in the world. And they treated me like a saint. But God was watching me. That's all right. yeah. uh, if it wasn't for the Lord, I don't know where I'd be right, right now. He was watching me. Yeah. And I'm talking about me because I can't tell him your testimony. Yeah. But I can tell him what happened to me. Yeah. He was so good to me. And then, I, I mean, I've been dead three times. You know, how many times can a person die? Jesus died, so I must have been in a coma or something because God died. This Jesus died. He got up and he walked around. I got up and drug around on the floor, so I couldn't have been too dead. You know what I'm saying, y'all? God will take care of you. He will bless you. He will heal you. And all you have to do, I'm about to lose this, all you have to do is just Ask him. Yeah, and he's right. right there waiting for you to call on him. Yeah. And just say, Lord, Lord. Heal, me heal me in the name of your son, Jesus. Yeah. Your and son you know what? Jesus. A lot of us don't have enough faith to believe That's that he right. will. I believe. I believe. 
You have to believe it. And God just, and you know, stop begging Jesus. Don't beg him. Say, Lord, I thank you. I thank you and I know it's done. Because I know God is real. It's done. I used to watch my mother. It would call her. We'd get on the back of that buckboard and we'd go to those people's house. Say, so-and-so dying. Mama said, they're not going to die uh, 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 unless I don't get there. <laughs> we ride the back. My, Walter, hang the light. We don't know what time we're coming back. Hang the light up on the buggy. Lord have mercy. Them was the days. <laughs> Them was the good days. Yeah. Then I had to leave home and be a little bad girl. But it's okay. Look what God did. Yeah. I'm standing up here with a collar around. I'm yoked. Thank you, Jesus. Right, Ooh, Lord have mercy. I, I, and uh, mama would go lay hands on people. I used to lay there and watch mama. I said, Lord, I want to be like her. I wanted to be like daddy too, but he just worked me so hard. He used to have me laying bricks, digging, uh, uh, what you call it, around the building, foundations and all that stuff. I said, oh, God, daddy killing me out here. But he was teaching me how to act around the men that worked with him. And today, I have that in me. And I protect myself, and I can protect myself now because I know. But I'm so stupid sometimes, you know, I can be stupid. But my daddy, my daddy did teach me the right way. You know, I'm human, and I have been stupid. But daddy taught me. But my mother, when she laid them hands on in the name of Jesus, come out! And I see the man get up and walk, go back to the field and plow. I don't want to go back to the field and plow. But that man did, Lord have mercy. I guess, I guess somebody ready, wants some healing right now. They can come and let me lay my hands on them. <laughs> yeah, Jesus. Okay. <laughs> the night is far spent. The day is at hand. Let us therefore cast off the work of darkness and let us put on the armor of light. Let us walk honestly as in the day, not in rioting and drunkenness, not in chambering and wantonness, not in strife and envying, but put ye on the Lord Jesus Christ and make not provisions for the flesh to fulfill the lust thereof. Yes. Oh, Lord, I'm so glad he took me out of that. No. I ain't lying. Hey, really? I, I, I thought that that was the way to be. But God knows but what God, he's... Man. But God. Yes. Y'all hear me? I, ain't, I, I, I don't mind telling it. Okay. It's done. It's over. It's yeah. done. Preach. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Now, we the people of earth began with nothing, but there was a God. Yes. We today as a people have become haughty in our ways, as though the world, as though the world is, it belongs to us. We are nothing without the Holy Spirit who lives in us. Do we know what that is? Well, well. Without the anointing of Christ Jesus, yeah. we are as the cockers lying dead, prey to the buzzards and other animals yeah. waiting to devour it. Yeah. Yes. 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 You know, some of the animals are human, yeah. waiting to devour your good spirit. You can't let them have it. The Holy Spirit will let you know when those animals are around you. Yes, yes. When they are about you. And you can't let them have it. Daddy taught me a little bit about that part of the Holy Spirit too. Thank you, Jesus. You know, I love my people. I, you know, I feel so sorry for some of the people that don't have fathers. You know, you know, uh, sister, it's good to have a daughter that has a father. A real father. I'm not going to say that to the father right there because he knows. Uh, do you know where the Holy Spirit lives in all people? All right. If they will ask the Holy Spirit in, these sophisticated people, educated, minimum wage earners, homeless people, little children, these intellectual, 
should be taught early about Jesus. Turn on the radio, the television, and you hear daily about young persons, any persons being injured or killed. I was a bold child. And I know if I wasn't trained as a child, I wouldn't be here today. It was difficult enough avoiding demonic influences in that country. I don't have to even tell y'all about the country and the demonic influences. While being educated about the Holy Spirit, God will always let you know when to bow out. I tell young people when I run upon them today, and they look, you can see the fear in their spirit. Mm, yeah. And I tell them, I, I stop them right in front of their parents, and I'll tell them, I say, baby, do you have anybody bothering you? Because you can see they've been bullied. And I tell them that when they feel or identify trouble, yeah. don't run. Yes. Don't run. Just back away. Ease away. Nobody's paying attention to you unless you just take off. But ease yourself out of that mess and uh, let and 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 uh, where am I? Uh, and, and and go, and God will protect you. That's why it's important for us to train our children today to know who God is, to know who Jesus is, to know why that baby was born. You know, I feel funny because I was born on Christmas Day. But mama don't want nobody to know it. She was so afraid I was going to die early like Jesus. I'm still here. I ain't going to tell you my age right now. Ah. (laughs) Yeah, Yeah, don't run from trouble. The anointing of the Holy Spirit will rise up in your belly. Everybody say, oh, the heart, the heart. The heart is pumping blood to keep you alive. Yes. When you know the Holy Spirit is around, you get that feeling right here. You hear that? Yes. That's when you have to watch the Holy Spirit and move on that. Yes. You know what I'm talking about? Come on. Come on. Yeah. Live so God can use you. Yeah. Yeah. The feeling you get when you decide to do something that you know is wrong it is God who tells you when to do yes. and what to do, not to do. Uh-huh. What to do and what not to do. Mm-hmm. And uh, uh, do something. Where does this feeling come from? From yeah. Jesus who lives oh, in right. you. Well, He's yeah. not out here in, in a spirit realm that, you know, them demons. He's in you. Right. You got more power than you know. That's right, Richard. More power than you will ever know. And I just talk bold about it because I know I got power. And I ain't going to hit nobody. (laughs) That's not the kind of power Jesus is all about. I used to be a kind of halfway bully, but I was scared. (laughs) From uh, the the thump, thump, thump in your chest is fear. You see what I'm saying? That's fear. But the rise up in your belly is the Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. Praise God daily. Pray daily. Meditate on him day and night. You know, after a while, as you continue that march in him, I I got this thing about the army, you know, because that was a good thing for me. As you would say in the army, run on and see what the end going to be. But when you uh, continue to pray, it becomes a part of you. It's it's you. You don't have to worry about it anymore because God is always with you. That Holy Spirit, it showers you with his blessings. You hear what I'm saying, y'all? It's the truth. Ah. Worldwide, it showers you with his blessings. Thank you, Jesus. Glory. Just thank him all the time. Yes. Thank him until you find where is all that fright? Where is all that fear? It's gone. Yes. And if it ever attacks you or approaches you again, just say thank you, Jesus. Yes. 
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes. That's the highest praise yes. of the Holy Ghost. Yes. Thank you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When I was a child, the country churches would sing, Come to Jesus. That's what they were saying then. And we'd all go up there, come to Jesus. We didn't know what we was coming to, but we went because we had to. What them old folk would do. I remember, I was called Old Lady Liza. You know who I'm talking about back then? Old Lady Liza would come and drag us. She would switch us up there. Come on, let's go to Jesus. We didn't understand. Come to Jesus right now. Right now, right now, come to Jesus right now. Then they will sing about he will save you. He'll save you. We won't go sit down. What's messing with us for? You know, we was arrogant little children. But my God, it stayed with us. I love that old lady. I can still see her face. I can see her coming up the country road with her apron on, coming to see what the baby got to say. I don't know what I was saying to her, but she, I would go bad, bad, bad. I, was, I remember her when I was in the playpen. That's how her spirit was with me. I remember that. But now, let's sing this. I believe I'll run on. See what the I believe I'll run on. I believe I'll run on. I believe I'll run on. See what the end's gonna be. Well, John declared, That's I I'm got talking. a long wide road oh, yeah. up in heaven. See what the end gonna be oh, i believe i'll run oh, on see what the end gonna be believe i'll run on see what the end gonna be amen hey. amen let's give reverend donald's a hand Hallelujah. Thank inspiring you, word today but let us stand somebody might want to come to jesus and we extend the invitation over the doors jesus. of the church come to jesus, come to jesus. Come to Jesus. Jesus.